43, fully committed. When you relied on the Lord, he delivered your enemies into your hand. For the eyes of the Lord reign throughout the earth to strengthen those whose hearts are fully committed to him. You have done a foolish thing. And from now on you will be at war. Second Chronicles 16, 8 through 9. At one time, King Asa trusted that God would provide for the needs of Judah. Toward the end of Asa's reign, something happened in the king's heart. He forgot that God had always been faithful, and he decided to take matters into his own hands. Asa stopped believing God would provide, and he stopped seeking him. So Asa's once devoted heart, and he turned to politics, money, and force to get his way. The result, God decreed, from now on, you will be at war. God knows we are prone to wander and forget his goodness. He is not looking for perfection. He is looking for hearts that trust him. He wants us to stop trying to control our circumstances and outcomes. Instead, when he chooses to trust God and wait patiently for his provision, he promises to be our strength. He gives us peace and softens our hearts in the midst of life's hard seasons. It's a moment-by-moment -moment conscious decision. I will trust you right now. God's eyes are searching for those who are committed to him. When his eyes fall on us, may he see a heart of trust. Lord, Remind me of your past faithfulness so I can trust you to be faithful in my present circumstances.